Good Friday morning, Glads. I'm Anthony Berkey. And I'm Jada McDonald, and this is your KWHS News. College visits will resume soon, so stay tuned for upcoming visit information. In the meantime, if you are planning to apply to Adams State University, mark your calendars for this. Adams State is holding their application power hour here on Tuesday, January 10th from 9 to 10 a.m. They can waive your application fee and let you know instantly if you are accepted. Sign up at the Counseling Center for your pass. Time to find out what we're having for lunch. Miss Betsy? Today's Friday. Wow, two more weeks to go till Christmas break. Guess what? I'm excited. How about you? Okay, today we're having barbecue baked chicken. Have a great day. Thanks, Miss Betsy. That sounds great. Freshman Council invites you to eat at the Southgate Chipotle on Tuesday, December 6th from 4 to 8 p.m. Tell the cashier that you're there to support WHS Freshman Council. If you need more information or to get a flyer, contact Ms. Hines in room 7. Now here's the sports team with your sports update. Good morning, Glads. I'm Elijah Clark. And I'm Dylan Ham. And this is your Gladiator Sports Update. Winter workouts for baseball are well underway in Bowers Gym. Here's the schedule. Tonight, freshmen and sophomores report at 4 p.m. Juniors, seniors, and returning lettermen report at 6 p.m. Girls basketball opened their season last night at Lewis Palmer, and the Lady Glads took home their first win of the season. After slipping by St. Mary's with a score of 153 to 130, Girls Swim and Dive travels to the Fountain Valley School tomorrow for a meet at 10 a.m. I'm Elijah Clark. I'm Dylan Ham. Have a great weekend. Back to you, Jaden and Anthony. Thanks, guys. Hey, Glads. DECA is still collecting pop tabs supporting the Ronald McDonald House. Your donation helps ill children have a safe place to stay during their medical procedures and help DECA secure a spot at National. Last year, DECA donated 17 pounds of tabs. Their goal this April is to donate 50 pounds of tabs. To beat the record, DECA needs 300 pounds. We help DECA get there. Drop off your donations at Miss Hellebrand's mailbox or room 159. It's almost time to draw for the first semester golden ticket power prizes. We sat down with Mr. Scala to find out what prizes are available. Here's what he had to say. Good morning, Gladiators. I just want to thank all the students who come to school every day and demonstrate power, pride, ownership, work, excellence, respect. We have a, a new incentive for you, and all of our teachers receive one of these golden tickets. All right, so just like Willy Wonka got his golden ticket, we hope you get your golden ticket. What that golden ticket will get you are a lot of different prizes. For this semester, we do have some great prizes for students, and what we will do is we will place your golden ticket in the box that you want. So for example, if you want a ski pass, we have two free ski passes to Loveland. Uh, we will put that in a box and you will have the opportunity to win. We also have a free pair of shoes at the Runner's Roost. You get a $175 pair of shoes if you'd like. They have some pretty expensive shoes there. We also have these skateboard decks uh, for any of those students out there that like to skate. And lastly, another option for you are all these gift cards. So we'll do multiple drawings. We have a $50 movie pack, some iTunes gift cards, Buffalo Wild Wings, and Applebee's. And those range from $25 to $50. We have a great prize uh, for second semester. That's this beautiful 40-inch TV. Uh, flat screen, Samsung, great brand, great TV. This is going to be for second semester, so keep doing the right thing. Uh, we'll do the golden tickets again second semester. So again, every teacher has a golden ticket. Uh, the last day to give those golden tickets out will be uh, December 2nd, so good luck. Hopefully uh, you will get yours and you'll have the opportunity to win one of these awesome prizes. We will be doing the drawing uh, during KWHS News uh, the week following December 2nd. So thanks again for demonstrating pride, ownership, work, excellence, respect. Have a great day. If you have not dropped off your golden ticket in one of the boxes in Mr. Scala's office, please do quickly. Winners will be announced on KWHS next week. Good luck. The Security Lions Club is selling fresh Christmas trees again this year. Trees are sold in Big R parking lot. All of the proceeds go to Kids Spree, which gives clothes to elementary students in Whitefield School District. Tell them that you saw this announcement and receive a $5 discount. Glad's the 180 Club is taking donations for their holiday food baskets. You can bring in non-perishable food items or cash. Last year, the club assembled 17 food baskets and they want to beat that number this year. Bring your donations to Mr. Sickmiller or any math teacher as soon as possible. 
GLADS. If you're ready to get into holiday spirit, the community center is hosting its 11th yearly holiday tree lighting celebration on Tuesday, December 6th from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m. To help families in need, you can bring donations of non-perishable foods, new unwrapped toys, and gently used coat. They also have crafts, story time, hay rides, s'mores, and a whole lot more for your enjoyment. Bring your whole family. Third annual Whitefield School District Toy Drive began yesterday and runs through December 15th. Bring new unwrapped toys to the Christmas tree by the main office. Help spread cheer and positivity to those in need this holiday season. Congratulations to the class of 2017 for winning the Senior Council Book Drive. The seniors brought in $60 and 10 books. For winning, they will receive an early lunch on Friday, December 9th. That is it for today. Have a great weekend. I'm Jada McDonald. And I'm Anthony Berkey, and this is your KWHS News.